What's happening, y'all? It's your boy Demar from TD Boys, and I'm back here with another video. Today I'll be doing an epic, 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 and epic sneaker collection today for you guys. I got all my shoes laid down right here. Now, before I get started with the video, I know I got more shoes than I had before. No, 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 I had more shoes than I have now. I like the most shoes I think I ever had was only about 60 pairs of shoes, but I sold them all because I didn't like them, and it wasn't as hype, but it's not about the hype, it's just about asking me like them or not. I used to buy shoes by just shoes, whatever shoe it is, I don't care, I just buy it. I, but I'm not doing that no more. I, I sold all them shoes, and then gone out of my collection, and I got some more shoes that I really like, and I have about one, two, three, four, don't know how many more. Ooh, that rhymes. Yeah, you bugs the rap. But yeah, I got a lot of shoes here, and I got a lot of shoes. That's pretty fire. But I'm not starting from like hype to no hype or high price to low price. I just start off with whatever I see, whatever comes up. I might do it, might not. But let's have on. Start with the first shoe. We have starting with the first shoe. I mean, we have a pair of RBS right here. This is my workout shoe. I know you're like, what in the real? I told y'all I'm not starting off with the best shoe to the worst shoe. But RBS shoe right here. These are pretty comfortable, you know. Very comfortable sneaker. I recommend you guys buying these shoes right here. They're pretty fresh. Start with the second sneaker. I like these right here. They really mean a lot to me. No, they don't. But they're very comfortable. The end of the triple black sneaker right here are pretty fire. I like these shoes. I wear these every once in a while. They're comfortable. You ready to anything? They're all black. Whether it was um, shorts or pants, either one, it don't matter. You will do with joggers. They are solid. Black with red. Pull tab. In different languages, very dope shoe. Yeah. <gasps> now this shoe right here is for when I'm trying to be classy or just like in not in a mood to wear like a specific shoe. They got a name to it, but these are a pair of Tummy Hill figures right here. These right here are pretty nice. This is probably one of my best quality shoes I got in my collection. These ones right here are pretty solid. It's a cream color with the Tummy Hill figure on the back. I like these. They're classy. They're very comfortable. And they got white bottoms on it, so that's why they look like really white. I mean, really dark. I mean, dirty. I mean, yeah, but they solid. I like these, man. They really nice. They clean. And before I get to any of my, any more of my other shoes, I just know all my shoes are authentic. All right, they not fake. Take your time to do screenshots of them. Say they fake or not. They gonna look legit. Okay, so you put in the comments that my shoes are authentic. Um, authentic. All right, so for the next shoe, which is the fourth shoe, I have a pair of um, dead stock never worn Vans. These are here, I never worn, I haven't worn these yet. These are Vans in the Penis Collection, I mean collab. These are very nice, very dope shoes. Very nice, cool, I like these. These are really nice. And yeah, I know I will buy these, you know. I want to see myself wearing these, but as of now, I do see myself definitely wearing these right now. Cause like they dope, they just dope shoes, you know. They're penis collab, Charlie Brown, you know. For the fifth shoe, yes, I did customize these, so they're not torn up. I thought about doing an off white type of look to them, and I did this customization all by myself. Don't blame me or nothing else. But I have these Adidas tubular right now, I think. Adidas tubular, I got a lot of cool designs to them. I really like them, they just don't look right on feet, so I don't know. I'm just I have my collection, I might do whatever to them, I don't know. I say don't mind right here. And I say look back, whatever, I don't know. I just thought about doing this. I just cut some scissors, cut this, did like a little off-white type of zip tie right here, or whatever. I don't have no off-white, but I will be getting some off-white later on right now. I'm not in the mood for that right now. And it's hot. But, uh, I don't want to this. I did cut these recently, but they did get a little marks in the inside. But I have these slip-on shoes, the Diamond Supply Collab. Make sure my camera gets it. Come on, camera. Diamond Supply right there. Okay, yeah, so these are the Diamond Supply slip-on shoes. And yeah, Boo J Collab. Very nice. I want these one time. I got a gum stain on the bottom. Why well, I got them on my leg anyway? I got these um, pretty recent. Diamond Supply. Now I got a little mark on here. Okay, where is that? I already see the mark. There you go. Look, Nick, right there. Nothing crazy, but they still rebel. Cause I'm still wearing them. Okay, so I know it have me get to no heat lately, but I got a little bit of spice now. And now these right here, I haven't worn these yet, but I do know about these pretty used. But they still, I still pay, you know, I'm out for them, all right? 
but these are used. They still look in pretty decent condition. And yes, the Jordan Tens do some shoes like Jordan brand do have creases in them already made with them. You can go do your research about people having creases in the shoes already when they brand new or not. But any other way, Jordan 10 OVO. Yeah, you will got the Jordan 10 OVOs right here. They're pretty dope. Sneaker. Very nice. Caught mine's in the size 10, the OVO, just in case you think I'm joking. That's OVO right there. They look very DS. They look dead stock, never worn. These are my right here. I can't wait to break these out. But yeah, they're pretty dope. You go to the other pair. Very nice sneaker, man. I love these. These are here cool. OVO right there. I love these shoes. Can't wait to wear them. I'm looking for an OVO shirt. So if you got an um, OVO shirt, put down in the comments below. I wear size medium. Look for an OVO shirt to match with those. Cause I need to find an OVO shirt to wear. All right, so for all of, out of all my sneakers I have, I had these for like the longest. Literally, I had these for the longest, and I'm still gonna keep them forever for the longest for a reason. That I don't want to get it to, but these ones right here, the Joy Seven Colonia Knights. These right here are pretty dope. You know, they look brand. They still look pretty good, but from the back of it, got a little creasing right there from the back. See that this is a little messed up, but I had these for like these about sixth grade, and I'm in the ninth. No, I'm in the 10th now, so I think about four years. Yeah, that's the way I can't get my shoes. But yeah, still got the um, brand in the inside of them. Jordan 7s actually got some great quality, you know. Pretty nice with the suede. They get a little white from here. I washed these one top before. So we messed them up. Not really, you know, but they still look pretty decent. Still look nice, you know. The creasing, hardly can see any creasing in the midsoles. Pretty decent shoe. I want to turn it ass. All right, so for these shoes, I saw these since I, I saw a store, and I really liked these, okay? Um, they really like that collab sneaker. Now, I don't have the other pairs that everybody else have, but I do got the Pharrell Williams HU Tennis. I don't have the Human Racing version. Well, these are the Human Racing, I'm tripping. I made the NMD version. I'm really looking forward to copying those NMD versions, because for now, I do got these right here. These are solid. Like, they look comfortable, they're not like comfortable, comfortable. They comfortable, though. They just feel like a shoe. Like it's on your feet. I'm just looking at the time right quick, sorry. But yeah, these, they're cool, you know? Nothing crazy. Got the little bird. Now, I know many people don't have these shoes, but I do, because it's like a classic shoe. These are this, I've never worn. And these are a woman's shoe. But they, I could fit these, because they're like a woman's 12 or whatever. I don't know. There's some right here. But um, yeah, these are a woman's shoe. I will admit that. I ain't tripping about it, because they look like a man's shoe. These are our case whistles right here. These ones right here are very clean. I did lace them up. Pretty neat. I'm surprised I lace these that good. But yeah, I got case suits in there. Yeah, these are dope. You know, I really like these. You know, I'm trying to say, you know. But these are here are nice. I like these. Put on some black pants with these and some with a gray shirt. That's a fit for the day. Or forever. Because these ones right here are pretty nice casual sneaker with the all suede on the top. And the bottom just solid gray. You know, this is just a solid sneaker. I had some of the Jordan ones like these in the same look of it. My dear sell those. I should trade those for the shoe that's coming up. Okay, so here, here go the shoes right here. I did trade for it. I'll tell me, comment down below actually if I took a W or L. But these were the hype of shoe of 2018. It's not about the hype. I just like the shoe. And I always did try to get these for a long time and I finally caught them. Not actually just now recently, but I just caught these about five months ago. I think or three. I don't know. But I um, did trade for a pair of Ocean Boots. I love this colorway. This colorway is pretty dope. For this to be a pink shoe, this is a dope colorway. I really like these right here. This Ocean Boots 3.0. These are the 3.0s right here. I had a lot of pairs. I had like three pairs of Jordan ones actually. And I, and I sold two pairs and I still got one pair. I'm gonna show you guys probably later on in the video. But these ones right here are clean. I like this colorway. These are a comfortable shoe, you know. I thought those would be that comfortable as they are, but they're actually a comfortable shoe. And that should give you a little bit of height. A height, I mean, a little bit of height. So yeah, if you're trying to get a little taller, I think you should get some copy of a pair of ultra boots, you know? I wore these a few times from here and there. Continental grip. Continental is like a tire, so you know, these will have everlasting grip on the body of sneakers. So you like burn grip on your shoes, like Air Forces. I do have, I had so my Air Forces too, darn. I saw a lot of pairs of shoes that I had. I wish I never sold them now. But I had a pair of Air Forces. The stars do get, um, the stars on the bottom of the Air Force does go away pretty quickly. But I don't have those no more, so I can show you. But I do have my stars on mine still, but I don't have them. <sighs> Just forget it. 
uh, your boy got a pair of Nike Air Max 97. These my little brand new on here. No cap. Hold on. Hold on. Let me get that flash. There it goes. It's back on there. They my little pretty desktop. Uh, trust me. I wore these mugs a lot. So you know what I mean? A lot. I mean, a lot. And for this colorway to be like this crispy, that's how you know I take care of my shoes, man. I definitely do take care of my shoes. I still got the shoe things in here and everything. I take care of my shoes, man. You know, that's wearable. When you wear them a lot, you do see that crease in the 97s. But these nose right here do so pretty bright with the flash on. Let me show you guys real quick. See, I told you guys, these muscles pretty bright. Not like a futuristic shoe. So I like about the 97. I am looking forward to a couple of the uh, 720s and a little bit. Yeah. But these muscles are pretty bright, you know. Yeah, I told you guys, told you guys, them pretty bright. And I do got some more shoes coming up and a little bit. So I do got the Jordan 4 Raptors coming in. Not the Drake OVO signature version. Nah, not those. But I do caught the 2018 version. And them was pretty fire. And I've been looking for those forever. Those are my dream shoe. And I finally caught them. They're coming in around the end of the month. So, you know, your boy is pretty happy for those to come in. But these right here, these are dead stock. Never worn. I'm going to pay 40 bucks for this shoe. 40 bucks. I still got the tag on it. I'm keep the tag on the pocket for as long as I can to take come off the shoe because of my Vans I had. Yeah, them, the, uh, the tag on the Vans came off. Not the ones I just sold you guys, but another pair I had. That I sold. No, I didn't sell those. No, no, I didn't sell those. I actually gave those to uh, my boy Damien off of TD Boys. Hope you enjoy those, but I feel like I should. I deserve to get a bag for them because, you know, I'm a cool dude. But, like, I wish I had killed them. But back onto the shoe. Yeah, these are these young 96. These are pretty dope, man. I really like these. This I've never worn. I'm gonna pay 40 bucks for this shoe. This shoe also sold a 3 young right here. I don't want to show you guys really because that's gonna mess up the timing. But yeah, these ones right here are dope, you know. I recommend you guys wearing these. They're like a dash shoe, which I really like about these. They're pretty dope. On to the next shoe. Okay, for these shoes right here, these are probably like the oldest shoes I got in my all of my old, like all of my shoes. These shoes are the oldest I have. And I haven't even worn these yet. They about these pre on the wood admit that. These ones right here, the Jordan 7 Burdos. 2011 edition. The only way you can tell from the 2011 edition and the 2015 edition that came out is the midsole, which is actually black on the 2015 model. But I did caught these in the 2011. I have to go farther back on the shoes. So yeah, these about right here, at least about eight years old. These ones right here is eight years old. And I do got a little chip in them from here and there. So yeah, I don't know if I should wear them, but just keep it in the box until I get my shoe shelves coming in. But yeah, these ones right here are pretty. Look at this stock. Just because of the age makes the shoe has a little chipping in it. But otherwise, these ones right here are brand new. Had the shoe things in them. These are size 11, by the way. These ones right here are clean. I like these. But on to the next shoe. Now this shoe right here was a pickup I had no clue I was gonna get, you know. Like majority of these shoes, how did these shoes probably just came out the blue? I just like just woke up on there, but like I got those shoes, you know. But these came out the blue. I had no clue I was gonna get these. I was looking forward to get these a while ago, but I never thought I would get them at this day. Cause like I just got them out the blue, you know, just got them. Just too so shot them. It was pretty clean. Got them, you know. But these right here are fresh, man. I really like these shoes, bro. The not game at 270s. I'm looking forward to get the 720s, I already said that. But these ones right here are pretty clean. I like these. These ones still look dead stock. But they are worn. Way well, you can tell they are worn. Because this cleared up. But a little crease in them right there in the midsole. Because this is very soft cushioning. It's the midsole. But this bubble in the back, man. This is not just for design. This stuff actually works. Man. This stuff is actually comfortable. I went to the carnival. Like the huge the rodeo carnival. These shoes are the best for the, um, the carnival to walk around here and there. This one got some walking in it, and they still look pretty clean, and it was comfortable during the times, man. These come with a little wrapping in it, but these ones right here are the best shoe ever to wear. For this to have a white bottom, I don't know how that's still white. That's crazy. But I wore these pretty much about 10 times. No cap in my nine. No, I'm not. Oh, these ones right here are fresh. <sighs> this is the last sneaker of my collection. I do got more coming in. But for this shoe, I'm about to give y'all guys a hint. In fact, should I give y'all a hint? Yeah, I'ma just do it. I'ma just do it. Yeah, but this shoe right here, I'm gonna give y'all a hint. 10 seconds of what shoe this is. 10, 9, 8, 
seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. <laughs> if you guessed it, you are right. The Jordan 10. I'm a Jordan 1 got a rave right here. The Blue Lagoons, these look dead stock. I have worn these, man. I have worn these about three or four times, about five times. I caught these when they first dropped, too, and I just didn't like, no, I ain't gonna say that. I didn't like how they looked at my feet. It's just like pants, like the pants you gotta wear with these do not look right with them, bro. I'm sorry. I'm just being honest. I like these, man, but they really cool, man. I want these a few times from here and there. And these ones right here, that color on them just pop. The inside come with the Gatorade, um, no, I'm not Gatorade. It's a Nike Air looking logo in it. Shoe is in it. Uh, Nike Air in it. Oh, I still in the way. Forget it. But it's got come with the green, come with some green insoles in it, which I like. And it's right here. Be like Mike, which is dope. And for this shoe, got the Gatorade logo on the inside. Forget the shoe is in I just forget it. But yeah, these ones right here are pretty solid. You know, I recommend you guys getting a pair of these. And I might get these custom because, like, I see a lot of people customizing these now. This colorway, especially the orange, the orange ones, I would have them now because they had like, people got to be able to customize that. Actually. It looks really pretty fire. But these right here are pretty clean right here, too. I might get these custom with the black right here, probably like a white check mark or a black check mark to go with it. These mugs will be solid. If I do get a customized, I will show you guys. I promise I will. But I'm gonna put it down here. But yeah, guys, that's the end of my sneakers. Um, I will give you my guys my account to my five miles or oh, offer up if you guys are interested in some shoes I might sell. Might be a something collection, I don't know. But these shoes I have showed you, I will probably keep for that. I ain't gonna lie to you until I can't fit them no more. Probably, I don't know. Because I love these shoes I got right here. These right here, I probably want my most comfortable shoes. I did walk on two miles and you know on the trail me you know because i worked out but other than that man that's the end of the video hope you guys like my sneak collection give this video a thumbs up if you did enjoy it other than that this is the marcus and i'm not out yet let me keep saying some more stuff let me think oh yeah so yeah customization on these sneakers bro tell me what y'all think about these man just tell me what y'all think I feel like I did a great job. You know, you would have to hold my breath every 25 seconds to go out the door at the briefly again because this sharpie had a strong smell in it. But, yeah, them was pretty dope. And, by the way, I will say again, sorry about that. I will do another sneaker collection by the end of the year. No, not by the end of the year. I mean, by probably around the end of summer, probably. And, yeah, probably around the end of summer. Many of that, bro. I got a lot of shoes coming in. I don't have a lot of shoes coming in. I have at least about two shoes coming in. And then for back to school shoes, that's coming in too. Wish I already did some school shopping a little bit from here and there, but I ain't talking about school right now. I'm just talking about in general. But my sneakers, you know, like these right here. I don't know if I might keep these. I don't know if I keep these. I like these shoes, you know, these are like an everyday sneaker. I don't know. This might go on my page. You never know. But uh, other than that, man, I'm out. Subscribe, like, and comment. Now, this should have said like, comment, subscribe, but I'm talking too much. What is I'm saying? I don't know. And yes, let me do a lot to y'all guys if y'all were thinking about it. Uh, we was not supposed to buy Bang. I will tell you guys that we are not supposed to buy Bang. We have no promo code. So, all that stuff he might say in his video or next video, because um, he did, you know, catfish me on a girl video. That's coming up later. I might not tell you. I can't tell you guys much about that, but y'all will watch that. But I will tell you that he had a promo code about bang and stuff like that. That's not in no video. I'm not trying sure to get sued. But if we do get sued, it's on him. I just want y'all to know that. I just need y'all to know that, actually. But, uh, yeah. That's it. Hope you guys like this video. Like, comment, subscribe. I'm going to keep asking you guys because I already know that y'all did. I believe in y'all, man. Y'all are the best people. I love y'all guys. But um, that's the end of the video. Make sure you thumbs up the video. I have to keep saying that. I'm just trying to add minutes. I'm not just like add minutes, but I'm just saying I'm not the end videos. How you end videos? But yeah, man. And ladies. Yeah. All right. Oh yeah. And by the way, um, follow TD Boys on Instagram. It's TD underscore Boys. Make sure you hit that up. We have no pictures on our account whatsoever because we just started an account. We don't know what to put on it yet. But we'll go put some latest some stuff on there lately. 
Uncle Sam. But anyway, that's the end of the video. Peace out, guys. Yeah.